So if you guys are fans of my Facebook page, this video is probably familiar to you. Well, I put that video out last weekend and uh, I felt like it caused a little bit of confusion because a lot of people were thinking I was getting rid of Holly even though I've talked about like I'm fixing her. But regardless, today's video is going to be about Holly and the, her absence of the in the vlog because we haven't seen her for a while and it's still going to be a little while before we see her and I wanted to kind of talk about that because I don't want people thinking I'm selling my bike or anything. Hi. I see a motorcycle slash scooter and want to proceed in engagement of said vehicle. And it's a motorcycle. Very cool. An oldie, but I'm sure a goodie. So guys, this is going to be a regular vlog talking about Holly with interspersed pieces of random. Uh, I'm going to try some new stuff out. You can see that i got a little GoPro down here. So, we'll try some double angle action, some randomosity action. I don't know if it's because Holly's been down lately or if it's just I've been doing what I do for so long. I feel like the vlog needs some spice. So we're going to try that out today. So Chase, what's happening to Holly? Where's Holly been? When's Holly getting fixed? All of these are valid questions. I've been seeing a lot of comments of like, you only had minor fairing damage. Why is it taking so long to get your fairings? Not as valid of a question, but another question nonetheless. So, where is Holly? And what does hashtag Holly Blackout even mean? Well, Holly Blackout does not infer the color of the fairings that she is going to have, but it infers that you will no longer be seeing Holly until Holly is fixed and ready to go, AKA a reveal video. I do also realize that a lot of you guys are new to the channel and probably don't even know who the heck Holly is. And is like, your girlfriend's getting repaired? So, oh, don't kill me, thank you very much, sir. You almost made a bad decision for both. So who is Holly? Holly is my 2009 Yamaha R6. I am currently on T, my 2009 2008 WR250X, also from Yamaha. For you guys that are new, Holly used to look like this. And then this happened, and then Holly looked like this. Well, Holly doesn't look like any of those three right now. Well, she looks closest to the last one, but she's a slightly different. Holly's going through a lot of changes right now. And it wouldn't be fun if I just kept showing you guys videos. A lot of you guys are probably like, well, we see her on CJDub2, my second channel where I do daily vlogs. Well, she's not going to be on there either. Holly is going on a total blackout. And starting today, you guys are not going to see any photos, any videos. She will not be in anything until she is in a very big video on this channel showing her off. And I realize it has taken a very long time to get Holly back together. You know, like there's, there's just a few things that are totally out of my control that I can't do anything about. And unfortunately, a lot of those things are very important pieces that I cannot release the bike without, I, without having those. I do apologize to all of you guys asking where Holly is all the time, but it is what it is. We just kind of have to roll with it however we roll with it. On a good note, T is running just fine. Surprisingly, since she does have the recall in, what T's problem is is shifting. Is that, that's T's problem. Also, to answer even more questions, no, I'm not selling Holly. Like I said, Holly Blackout means that video-wise, social media-wise, you will see nothing, you will hear nothing, I will tell you nothing. Until the day I put out a really cool video that you get to watch. So that should be awesome. You long-term subs might realize, but if you're kind of new, you might not. Do you guys notice that every year something happens that knocks me out of riding for like months? If it's not a theft, 
it's a wreck. If it's not a wreck or a theft, actually if it's not a wreck or a theft, I don't know what it is. Regardless, it seems like every single year, part of my 12 month riding season gets knocked down to eight or nine because of insert random reason here. Anybody notice that? Falcon slash Eagle game, which sounds like a really bird heavy game, but regardless, uh, I just happen to be a fan of the color scheme that the Falcons use. So I think it's ironic that I come down here and fit in with all the Falcons people. If you guys were not aware, I do not watch football at all. Like, at all, at all. I know the Falcons are a team because. I live in Atlanta. Other than that, I would have had no idea. It always trips me out when I see like no clouds in the sky. I feel like somebody forgot to push a button to release the clouds that day and they should have gone out, but because of somebody's negligence, they can't. That cop would probably not be happy with me if I wheelied next to him. Let's go up this way and take a right and go into that region. me I'm gonna take the bike lane and just go a little bit faster than the rest of you guys cops don't look over here don't look over here thank you are you turning are you turning are you turning oh you're turning take advantage get advantage taken all the bad decisions have been made by me it's one of these situations where I want to pull a garden snake and just get on the sidewalk and be like it's a free lane yay <gasps> motorcycle cop don't cut off the motorcycle cop. Be awesome, motorcycle cop. Be awesome. I wanted to stop and talk to him, but I feel like he would hate me for some reason. Probably because I left my turn signal on again. God dang. Oh! Oh yeah, just what are you doing? Whoa, let's just watch this explore and see what happens. What is the best outcome that could have happened from that? Somebody please let me know what was going through their head. So I'm gonna send this off to Yummy R6. Is that a small penis truck? It seems big enough. <laughs> Sounds like somebody gonna get in a damn wreck. I'm driving like a damn fool. Mad damn. Holy shit, that is the biggest mail truck I've ever seen in my life. Is that like a normal mail truck? Or is that like a mail truck that like ate steroids and protein? It was just like, Bruh. No, here BMW, I'll be nice to you. Oh, you're the douche. You're the douche. Nice. <laughs> this Sorrento's the asshole. I hope he feels like an asshole. Yeah? No, you can't go anywhere now. It's a physical barrier. Let's see who's driving the Sorrento. And the asshole looks like an old man. Awesome. Probably an Eagles fan who has no clue where he is. I don't mean to talk crap about security guards, but why the segue? You would think that it would be encouraged to walk so that you would be in more in a better physical shape so you could, you know, chase bad guys or something. I don't know. I'm just saying. Another motorcycle cop. Hell yeah. He's stuck in just as much traffic as I am. Let's see him be a boss. That cop just answered a phone on a motorcycle. Hi, Mr. Police Officer. Did you just decide that your job is so important right now that you need a phone? Are you going to pull him over? You should. You just freaking answered a phone call. We shall try. Don't cross a fucking road, you idiot. Oh my Jesus. You're really pushing that stupid girl stereotype really freaking hard. We're going to make it out of downtown eventually, guys. I promise. 
I don't really much understand horns. Oh, look at you. Look at you, genius. Oh, yeah. No, 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 go, you're idiots, come on. You guys make bad decisions, just saying. I was gonna turn left, but... Fox tried that, Delta. Well guys, this concludes today's Supermoto adventure. Just kidding, Baker, I love you. If you guys don't know, that was a joke on Baker X Derek's outro. Guys, that is it for me today. I hope I didn't confuse too many of you with the hashtag Blackout Holly stuff. And hopefully you now have a better understanding of when we will see Holly ETA soon-ish. Good news is she's gonna be awesome when I do finally get her made. And I think you guys are going to like her a lot. If you guys like this video, make sure to hit the like button. It is mucho apreciado for me -o. And I will see you guys on my next video. Later. You guys ever get excited when you see a helmet? You're like, oh, a friend. And then you're like, that's oh, a scooter. Which is still exciting because it's two wheels and all. Which is still exciting. Uh, cruiser. God, one level above scooter. It's still exciting and all because it's a two wheel brethren. But if it's a supermoto or a dual sport or a super sport or a sport tour or anything, bitch. I'm a bitch. Let's go. Thank you. But yeah, I'm gonna get some music playing. Try not to die. It's a life goal.